What's going on guys? It's Jose with Jay's Mobile Auto Glass. A different type of video, well video section of it, but this is more of an informative topic uh, speaking about how to file an auto glass insurance claim and what steps do you do so that your uh, the company you choose will do the job and not another company. So let's just go ahead and start from the very, uh, like the first point we need to do is Whenever uh, I get a call from a customer, a lot of times I will, they will ask me is how do they file through insurance? Right off the back, you will have to pay whatever your deductible is when it comes to your auto glass claim. So if you have a $500 deductible, you will be paying $500 for that um, job. Or you will, be paying the, you, you will be paying the auto glass shop your deductible of $500. So they will be physically collecting those $500. Uh, and now whatever else is uh, not covered, the, the insurance will cover, will pay for the rest of it. So, uh, my prices don't typically go higher than 500 unless it's something rare, and it's uh, the vehicle is equipped with a lot of sensors, a Land Rover it has heads up display, Mercedes, BMW has heads up display. Uh, a lot of times, my if your deductible is at 500, um, sometimes the price, my out of pocket price is a little bit better. But anyways, so you will be paying your deductible to the auto glass shop of your choosing. Again, um, a lot of insurance companies will go ahead and have speed dial, uh, safe flight, just because, um, and this is where it gets kind of tricky. A lot of times they're going to push you towards safe flight. Um, there's only two companies that they use for auto glass claims. Lynx Services and Safe Flight Solutions, which is, ran, which is run by Safe Flight. Um, depending on what insurance company you have, they will use either or. Uh, so what is it? State Farm, for example, will use Lynx services. Uh, I believe uh, Progressive uses Safe Flight solutions. So it just depends. This doesn't technically mean that Safe Flight has to do the job. If they use Safe Flight solutions, it just means that the process for the auto glass claims goes through their uh, insurance department. There, uh, they they kind of have a contract with them, and they take care of all the uh, negotiating and pricing when it comes to the claims. Uh, when, now, as you as a this will be the portion for the customer. Now, for the customer portion, uh, you need to call your insurance company and ask them if you if they use Safe Flight Solutions or they use Link Services. From there on, they should forward you to that department, and then they will uh, you will pretty much just tell them what glass company you want them to use, uh, and then they will email the referral or reference number to the uh, the glass shop. We really need that uh, that paperwork emailed to us before we get started on a job. I can't tell you how many times I will show up to a job, take care of it, and once we get done, they're like, oh, I decided to file through insurance, so uh, see you later, guys. I'm like, no, 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 that's not how it works. Um, that's probably one of the worst things you can do is wait till the glass shop gets done and then uh, decide to go through insurance because a lot of times the glass, the insurance company can also decline to cover it if the job's already been done, we kind of have to lie and say, hey, we haven't done this yet. We're scheduled for tomorrow or later this afternoon. So please, as a customer, refrain from doing that. That puts us in a little bit of an awkward bind and doesn't mentally prepare us because there is a lot more paperwork that has to be done. Um, when it comes to filing an insurance, when it comes to uh, doing an actual insurance job, we have to collect a lot more information when it comes to uh, how long a job, how many hours are allowed on the job. Uh, the NAGS list price, it's just a little bit more paperwork when it comes to filing through um, insurance and it really does help us if you guys don't wait last minute to decide to do that once the job is done, especially at that moment. Uh, again, so only two companies, every glass, co every uh, insurance company uses Link Services or Safe Flight Solution. Speak with your agent, ask them what they use. They'll give you the number, call. Sometimes you'll be on hold for a good minute, but we really need that reference number emailed to us. Um, again, if you do, if you do use Safe Flight Solutions, if your insurance company does use Safe Flight Solutions, do not feel like they are pushing you towards Safe Flight. That's not what they're they're not by law. They're not no uh, insurance company can push you toward a shop. It's uh, up to you to choose. Um, so you're more than welcome to choose your own shop of your of your liking. Uh, they just use Safe Flight to process uh, the, their insurance claims. Uh, really, really funny actually. A little fact here. I I prefer a Safe Flight Solutions. Uh, insurance jobs and a link service insurance job it, they're so much easier to process and quicker to get them uh, through than it does a link service link services actually takes you a little bit longer paperwork than a safe flight solutions which is kind of funny because i don't work for safe flight so i am my own company uh but again guys make sure you guys get those that, that paperwork emailed to us um but that's really it uh, you will be paying your deductible if you have a zero dollar deductible 150 dollar deductible 100 dollar deductible 
that is what you'll be paying. Now let's get to the another portion I just realized, I just remembered, is chip repairs. Not every company, not every insurance company will cover fully chip repairs, okay? Um, I charge, for, the national average for a chip repair is $70 out of pocket. Just to give you guys a, a, some, like a little bit of a thought there, before you go to another company to try overcharging you, the national average for a chip repair is around $70, okay? So if you're getting charged a little bit more somewhere else, um, maybe your insurance company, if your insurance company covers it fully, go ahead. I know State Farm, Geico, Progressive, USAA are four companies that are very good at covering 100% uh, chip repairs out of pocket. They will fully pay for it and uh, you are left with no, you don't have to worry about uh, paying out of pocket anything. But um, you have to check with your insurance company. Same process as before, call your uh, agent or your, uh, your insurance company and then they should forward you to that uh, department that they use, whether it be Safe Life Solutions or Lennox Services. Again, those are the only two that I know of when it comes to the major insurance companies. I have yet to have heard of a third one company that uh, that processes that processes uh, insurance claims. Um, hopefully, this video does help you out, guys. When it when it comes to filing those claims uh, a little bit quicker and easier. Again, the whole times is something that maybe they can get better at, but uh, we have no physical control of that as the auto glass shop. But please make sure let's uh, take care of that before you get to the shop. That will really help us out tremendously. And again, you can choose whatever shop you want. You are not forced to choose uh, a particular shop that is against the law. And um, again, hopefully this video did help you out. Make sure you guys join the Discord, leave a like, and subscribe. And I will catch you guys on the next video. Later.